Uh, uh. Hey. What the fuck you leave for? I had it right here. Oh, you're here to give me a Geo dude? Yeah, sure. Oh my, would you look at that? It really does look like a rock, and it seems to be the ideal weight, too. Oh, it's simply perfect. Thank you. With this Geo dude's help, I'm sure it really makes some scrumptious pickles. Yo, dude! 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 I wonder if they ever will. I mean, I know that they probably don't care to, but I wonder if we'll ever get it to where they actually you know, have. Like, it's one. Th I'm fine with it not having voice acting in the game, but I wonder if they'll ever just get. Like, because they have the audio to do it, like, at least from the shows. Maybe get the audio to have them say their names. I, mean, I don't really care either way. A neat touch, but I know if they don't want to, they don't have to. That there. Once. This, I don't. This right now. I saw the recipe, kind of, for all it was. I just need apricot. I have some iron chunks. Okay, hey, I found a mushroom, I think. Is this what you need? That's a nice springy mushroom if I've ever seen one. Glad you like it, DK. <laughs> Glad I chose you for my request. You got you got what it takes to be a fine mushroom for or whatever. By the by, did you have did you know that springy mushrooms like this one multiply in no time? That's why you'll find them all over the obsidian field lands. Versatile too. Fry them, stew them. They taste great either way. But I digress. Let's look at teach you my recipe. It'll, I'll just use that handy workbench over there. You need a workbench to cook. Here, the delectable mushroom cake. Loved by Pokemon far and wide. Throw one out in the wild Pokemon, it's actually uh, also to a nice mushroom snack. You can bet your bottom toadstool it'll get, go after a cake lure. Yeah, I can't put pressure on this thing or get a rock. Can you get like a rock with arms to do it? Guys, all about the mushrooms. Cake lure base. Get out there and throw a generous note. Whatever, just lure them with your famous mushrooms. DK's mushrooms. Back to that cave. Not even for the Pokemon, really. I mean, there is stuff I still need from, like, Choke. Whatever. Champ. That, I should say. And, uh, but, uh, it's the, um, fucking stone that they drop in their mines. Not a bad area. The problem is, now I have two weaknesses for electric flying and other flying. One's flying grass, one's flying bug. Get what the hell bug's even weak against. Or er, strong against, like psychic. Maybe. And maybe grass it beats up. Oh, dude. 69. Yeah, that sounds about right. I tried playing Crusader Kings 3 last. I think it was on Game Pass. I don't know if it still is, but I tried playing it, but 
I also am, like, stingy, and I don't do tutorials all too much. Like, I will most of the time, but, like, I'm like let me just wing it. I'm better at hands-on than just being given this shit and, and doing it from where they want me. So I ended up playing, and I was just, like, confused, and there was just a lot of drama, and I think I fucked some dude's wife. So... an interesting time. Holy fuck, that's the alpha. Found King, the alpha DK. Oh no, it's not a, it, well, it looks like a mushroom top, but I know it's not. This is like if, like, DK's experiments with mushrooms and a crab went too far. I mean, I, I like playing Civ, but, like, I can get away with a lot of problems, and it's a lot more simplistic, so I like those stuff. And Age of Empires, I already suck at, and... I already suck at that. Even though I, I, I even though I, I, tr I do enjoy myself, uh, RTSs and things of that nature. But some that are really complex, I just never really get into. It's one of those games that I think John would probably like because it's got a lot of things that he likes in that in-depth stuff and uh, he would actually pay attention to. It's just uh, and that I would play it with him kind of thing, but it would just be, uh, it would be a nightmare. The issue here is... Oh, so... I think I got to a point where I was actually beating up like the small area that I started in and was like winning in wars and stuff, but I couldn't tell you how. But I was doing it and then <laughs> it then it just turned into a lot of like the internal conflicts of the stuff in the game, which was fun to deal with, but I just found it funny because I think at one point I just fucked some dude's wife and then I had like some blackmail knowledge on him. Whatever, and I'm like, I don't know what's going on, but this game's awesome. <laughs> and then I just stopped playing, because I'm like, I don't know what's going on, but hey, good times. Odd Star Ravier, stop being a piece of shit. What if I just go behind? Oh, I think here's your prowess. What if I go behind you and throw the Pokeball? Back attack! <laughs> right in his face. Alright, fine. I guess I won't take it. Defeat you anyway, but I, you know, I wanted you catch more because catching them. I mean, getting the others to their form, sure, but I need to catch. That's why, like, I really like doing the Total War Warhammer style games, like, they're fun, 
But I'm fucking dog shit at that stuff. I literally raged quit a stream just because I was sucking so bad, and I wasn't really mad at the game. There was just certain mechanics that frustrated me. Baby, where'd I go? The fuck to you, dude? Really? I don't know why I threw this at you, but sure. Great, now I have two of them. Shadow Ball. I don't know if beating you with an electrical move will hurt, will work, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I don't know if that was on your list. Thunder Punch! Yep, beat with electric move. Yeah, I always, like, I enjoy those types of tactical things. Cause it's a little different than what I'm used to playing. It's, man, I'm dog shit at him. That works. That far with this. They're not kidding when they say that's a heavy ball. She got good with money there. Like, all of that internal stuff like that that you can do is always makes it fun because, like, Civ is so simplistic where I'm like, I wish that, you know, there were internal things like that going on, but they don't do it that way. That's why I like that stuff. But, um, I'm fucking stupid, so... When we came over here. Out of the nice Pokemon teleporting around. Need to do that. Right in the back. Do this all day, motherfucker. <laughs> Come on, you gotta get tired. Uh, I have 68 regular and 14 heavies. Heavies are the, like, they're more efficient if you hit them in the back. Because, like, there is a bonus if you hit them in the back as a surprise. But the heavies increase that percentage. But there are great balls and stuff, too. I just don't have the, uh, didn't have enough of the apricorn stuff to make it. Evolved form of Bidoof! God, they're heavy. Oh my god. They're so heavy to throw. No, don't run. Fine, if I can't catch you for my points, I'll just defeat you with electric moves, because that's also in the Pokedex. Thunder Punch!
Plus, I got an extra point for feeding it. No. Take it. You're Bidoof. These guys, yeah, you're not Bidoof. Evolved form of Bidoof, however you say it. Don't run. You deal with Pikachu now. I do kind of need some great balls to make this a little easier. Hooray! And like that you catch him and then just a berry. Okay. Over hill? No, not you, berry. Or the alpha. What level are you? 30. You know what? I'm feeling ballsy. We're gonna die here. Yep, that hurt. hurt so much. Pony time. Flame wheel. I mean, I definitely would have liked to have caught it, but I don't really need the alpha crit. if they'll come back. Yeah, I've never really played the game, so I wouldn't know. Then all the zoo bats. Not that one. Zoo bat. Damn it. This is what it's turned into. I could progress story, but I am all about getting some Pokedex knowledge done. Keep reading too fast. Sounds like a bunch of Rimworld issues I've had. They didn't really breed too fast, but... And they like to fuck occasionally. get over the fact that when DK's kid was born, once he had the ability to walk, he went for a gun. Thank you. 
suck at my throws. Boy, everybody. Huh? Ow. Really unnecessary, man. You didn't have to do that, or ma'am. I kind of figured, but you know, I thought I would try water pulse right here normal, so you have a lot of interesting moves. Sure. Obion's cute. Might not be everyone's favorite uh, evolution. There's a lot of uh, better ones to pick, but. I wanted to try something different with Fairy. I don't think I've really used Fairy all that much. Want to do bat? I have not caught that many of you in uh, daylight hours because I only see you at night. That he created tornadoes. I thought it was wobbling. Got worried. That distract you? Like, what the fuck? Yeah, like... I played Port Royal and Prey, I never, uh... Never got that... F like, I got somewhat okay in, but I didn't get far. But eventually, it's on my replay. Instead of current Prey, I played old 360 Prey, which, you know, the game that eventually never made a second one. Times. The game is a trip. Finale the other day of Chulup went up, and of course, wouldn't be surprised if someone did comment on it because it is a, uh, uh, you know, it is one of those things where, like, there is a certain amount of fans that know about it, things like that. And, uh, I feel bad because, like, the recording was, you know, the, the recording in session wasn't, was done in March. Of course, like, it's all said and done already, but it's like, hope you go back and 100% this, because there's a lot of cool things, and I'm like, as much fun as it might be to see some of the things, there's just sadly no interest in going back, because, uh, John has no interest in it, and, like, it's one of those things where if you never see it, the weirdness and stuff is so interesting, but, like, for John, it's already kind of, like, worn out, it, like, it's welcome, really no reason to want to go back like we weren't, we weren't as super invested in like all the little things of the characters that some people are attached to them 
we were just really focused on getting a hooker. Just the name of the love interest that we made that we had. I enjoyed Pray for what I played. I was just I don't know, I don't think I was in the mindset when I played it back then because I didn't enjoy it right away. Um, but I also was like, I, I don't know, it was weird. I wasn't, like, enjoying it, and I felt very overwhelmed really quick right off the rip, and I don't think I was in the mindset for that style of game, because I was playing a lot of, uh, other games that weren't Prey. And, I don't know, I just remember, like, I don't know, I'll stop and come back to it. I was also playing, like, a ton of other things. That was when I was a little bit more sporadic with my games and I wasn't playing as consistently with stuff as I could have been. Shit, a full-blown Pikachu. Yeah, I saw all the fun in it. Like, it seemed really fun. I just kept getting frustrated because the game felt like it needed a lot of, uh... Um... Stealth to it, it felt like. I don't know, there was a lot of stealth moments and I wasn't quite feeling the stealth. It's like I kept remember running out of ammo for a lot of it. I, I missed a lot of shots trying to fight the mimics. Um. And just getting annoyed because I was low on ammo with that. And then when I got into a fight with something, it like took out all of my stuff. I can't remember if I was playing on normal or it was during my phase where I was like upping the difficulty. Because it was like this weird order of a year phase where I was making things difficult for myself for some reason. But also my mindset was more towards Bioshock in it. So I was like, you know, fight everything kind of ordeal and it'll be okay for the most part on like full difficulty and that's not what happens with that and that what I don't know, it'll, it'll happen down the road. Just uh, don't be surprised if it's frustrating to watch because I won't be shocked if I suck at it, but I want to give it another try because it wasn't bad. It was just, hey. The fuck is Gyarados doing all the way up there? I made a couple of balls, but I never hit that one. I may have put them away, like. There is no way I'm gonna hit you. No way I'm gonna time this. If I had the other one that are nimble and a lot easier to throw, because there's a flying, like a sky ball type thing, like a lighter ball, I'm I'm not good with it. Like hurting my stick too. There we go, right on your tail. That doesn't mean it's a guarantee. Hey, can I have you? I should actually see what level you are. Might be better off trying to pick a fight with you, but I don't know how that's going to work. I could hit him with that. 25. You're, you're tough if I don't have the right shit for it.
same throws every time. I'm not gonna adjust. I don't improve. Erdus, why can't you be in, like, the water? Why do you gotta fly? Ain't you, like... I don't know, just... Hang out down here? Damn it, I had the angle too, and I fucked up. I don't think we're gonna be able to catch him. And if it's trading a stamina doing that, that's gonna take a lot. For back to back, literal back attacks. Spot. Throw it. Now I waste all my Pokeballs, I'm gonna have to go craft more. Now these are empty. Imagine if I actually throw a regular Pokeball and, like, in a realistic scenario where I just killed my own Pokemon and dropped the ball. But, I mean, I need to catch one of each, and I'm like, I don't know. I, I, there's probably going to be, like, a plethora of these later on, but, like, I don't want to miss my chance. Ow. Fucking dumb at throwing things, and the sensitivity is all weird for me. I'll come back another time, or just you know find a better spot to get uh, Gyarados. Pokeballs trying. What I want to do is head back to that tunnel. You know what's sad is a lot of my pizza place around me don't put hol uh, have jalapeno. People. No people do like that. It's funny, they don't have that. But one place, I think, at one point, I don't know if they still do, did alligator. I can't get a fucking jalapeno on my pizza, but you had alligator at one point? Something along that lines of me. What the fuck? I head back to heal. Get everybody all good. Try to get to that cave again, and then after the cave, just get some stuff that I want out of it. Uh, then we can maybe go on to the next. <laughs> Why? Oh, at least hard dust. Couple great balls. I don't know why I could ask you for a rest when I can just use the bed behind you, but... It's all just in one spot. I mean, I don't know about how I'm pe Like, I, I really don't care. I'm not that picky on topping. I like the thing, I'm probably gonna enjoy it, cause it's just... Whatever you throw on there, if I like it normally, I'll probably like it with... Oh, okay. Done. The thing that will tell me where these are. If not, if I really need to find more of them for points, if I am help on my Pokedex for stars, I'll just... But, uh, I, I really... You know, it's like sauce, cheese, and bread. So I'm not that picky on what can go on it. Occasionally I like something spicy, but to be honest, I'm very basic. I'll I'll end up just eating with sausage and sometimes I might be in the mood with or onions or some other topping. Sometimes I'll do white pizza with like broccoli and some other stuff, but sometimes it's one topping only. 
because if I eat too many toppings on one, I get a lot of stomach issues. It's better to keep it one thing than to mix so many things that my stomach has a lot of intestinal problems like distress. Gotta deal with the aftermath. Plus, I'm a weird... I have, like, a weird thing with consistency, so... I end up liking just one topping, because then everything is... Like, the bite is always the same. Granted, sure, the flavor might be kind of boring if, if it's the same thing over and over, but I I like having the same, like, I know what the con so If I order sausage, I know I'm getting sausage. No spites. But I'm not, uh... Not that picky with that stuff. I'm just weird and I don't like... I also just don't like a ton of toppings because sadly the places that I eat where I get pizza uh, can get a little too greasy and a little messy in the sense that it's like it kind of falls apart and if I get too many toppings it just literally like will slide off. But yeah, it's mostly one topping maybe depending on what... Kind of just depended on my stomach. Watching Kingdom come with it. We'll need to catch a couple of these. Eh, worst case, say I could do it on my off time. I'm playing this on my off time, doing some of this shit. Definitely be back in the cave catching. Amps and stuff. I think needs a little behind. Not normally that picky with all that stuff. Like, everyone will argue shouldn't be on pizza or don't do this. There's some really fucking stupid things that people just shock value, value for pizza toppings, but other than that, I really don't care. Brotch! Level 8, they can hit hard. Area that they're gonna want me at. Find myself how I found that cave. Honest, I don't remember. <laughs> kind of just mindlessly running until I realized that I could break that rock, and then lo and behold, I found cave. Also late for me, so my my energy is a little all over the place. Yeah, just the way things are, I end up eating, like, the same, like, five to six things, maybe less. Future's Pantry. Out of where? I 
Aerial Ace. across the tree shaking and swaying then you know it's something in it definitely didn't go down here but planning and then I haven't caught one of you yet I tried to be nice, it didn't work. Oh, it's all about weakening him, I was just really hoping to get lucky. Poison powder, Pikachu. In the use spark, I keep doing that. At least he didn't kill you. Go. Even though I'm not feeling up my greatest, I still want to stream for a good chunk of time today because I didn't get to stream yesterday, dude. Just fucking too much stuff that didn't go according to plan, followed by then a headache that never wanted to leave. available. That's why we're still going for a little bit, even though we'll probably wrap up eventually here. Hopefully it's just a head cold sinus thing and I'm not going to actually get sick, but we'll see. Could hope. Alpha doesn't turn because there's the big alpha cricket to his back. Back down. But... So the, I, I, I'll have to, I'll remember that cave later when I'm a little bit better in the head. On my off time, I'll go there and grab some more metal materials and catch some Pokemon. Also need to go to that spot where there was that fucking chip jar and see if I can get that. No, I don't know if I'll actually want chip jar, but I still need to catch one regardless. to see you. Hot up there. 
level are you? 32. God, I don't trust it. Pikachu's not strong enough. We run and scare things away. Get off of me. 15. God. TMZ. <laughs> the magical zoo. attention just catching him because that's always like the always thing to do I'm just having fun catching shit and getting this Pokedex worked out even though I don't care to get like I'm not really worried about 100% as more as I'm just getting them because of the stars for it might as well do the shit that's That marker that's been sitting there also I have is for the E on the last time, so I went there and never removed it. Just to remind myself of her uh E. back here, so let's go to the mission. Good. Read a report. Sure. Either way, we've seen him use Struggle Bug. Beated him. Caught a bunch. We'll find out when I go back. Now, let's just... Do at least one story thing. This is turning into Yakuza where I'm doing like a lot of just random shit and then it's like maybe, just maybe you'll get one main story thing. That will be the entirety of the session is one story. Because today has been a weird day. We, re we drove trains for some reason. We played a Disney game that turned out to be not bad and I might actually go back to it because it wasn't like... Not the worst. I mean, it's got all the things I like in the sense of farming and stuff. So, like, or not really farming, but, like, it's simple. It's not too difficult. It's just mindless, even though I don't give a shit about Disney crap at all. Just random to do. So, like, I don't care. I might go back to it for funsies on stream when I'm, like, just doing a chill thing or a random day. Anyway, I'm here. I just walk up to her and she's like, Hey, have you seen TMZ? I'm like, how's that invented yet? Oh, so even your professor decided to join us? Wait! Thank goodness I got here in time. As a Pokemon researcher, I could hardly miss out on a chance to observe an alpha now, could I? Suppose that is your business. Fine, as long as you stay out of my our way. Deer Track Heights. Yeah, I've been all around this place. Where I've come to pay tribute to a special Pokemon. A Pokemon descended from one of those ancient blessed by Almighty Sinnoh. Dilly -dilly -whoop. That's not it. That's only a troublemaker here to disturb the peace with its racket. I've already fought one of these. <laughs> Dilly -dilly -whoop. That's why you're here. F That's what you're here for, my dad. To drive that interloper from this place. I'll show you your Pokemon are ready for the battle. Oh, okay. I mean, I already healed, but thanks. Guess I got my PP back. On my word, what a large specimen. Little wonder Alpha 
Little wonder alpha Pokemon are feared across the land. They're all as oversized as this one. Exactly. Not only big, though. They are strong and made no moves that others are not kind, that do not of its kind. Not to be trifled with, let me tell you. Nevertheless, I believe you are stronger than this alpha, so show it that behind all that. Yeah. Size is a potent weapon in it itself. No doubt this alpha is powerful and hardy foe. Must face it. Make sure your Pokemon are strong moves at their disposal. Are larger than others and also knows moves that are rare for their species. They appear to be difficult, very difficult to catch. You have a great ball, so I have a couple opportunities to try if I really want to. I wish I had something to put you to sleep. In the distance, you just hear me yelling, Oh my god! It's like, not again with this shit. Yep. What's with the wild might? Thunderwave. Okay, Pikachu, you just came out here to do shit like that. Stop doing the whoop and me. Oh boy, I thought we were dead. How about a great ball? Let's try a great ball just for fun. Might be a waste, but why not? You're mine. That's it. I caught it. Are you impressed that I caught the thing now? Or I didn't really need it, but why not, right? A really impressive one, aren't you? Seeing someone b mess an alpha like that truly reminds me of the legendary hero of old. I also just caught it. Make sure your, your Pokemon are taken care of after facing such a foe. Only Pikachu got hurt, but for a good cause. In the world? It's the great Redeer. It's the blasted off again. Looks upon you with kindness, my dad. The Graver is taking a liking to you. That is fortunate. He's an esteemed Pokemon that can dash across the expanses of his place while bearing a human on his back. A human he deems worthy, at least. He is a blessing to all of us. To us all. Remarkable. Truly outstanding stuff. A Pokemon letting someone ride on it? Why? It's just like the ride... Like the ride Pokemon of Lola. Lola. Professor. Think things went smoothly? I'm here on Captain's orders. She said we'd be able to set up a base camp here once my dad took care of her request. About that, I know this was a joint decision by the commander, but still, is it really fine for us to set up more base camps like this? The region of the land is created by Almighty Sinnoh for the sake of its Pokemon. As long as your goal is to coexist, thrive together with the Pokemon, then I imagine you should be allowed to use this land. I mean, I'm catching them and taking them away from the land, but that's fine. Taking a liking to my dad as well. This is a good sign. You have my thanks for what you did today. Our clan leader will hear of how you aided us. I'll come to show my appreciation with a proper reward as soon as I can. That's not how that works. You give me it now. Well, if we're to coexist and thrive with Pokemon, we'll need to know them better. First step towards that is completing the Pokedex. Construction Corp should be here soon. They'll have our new base camp pitched in no time. Look, I raised that Pikachu from a Pichu. And that Pichu had the worst defense. And it's still not a great Pikachu, but it's it's my Pikachu. Here we are. 
A new base camp on it. I'll call it the Heights Camp. Now on, when you set on the village, you can ask to be escorted to this base camp right away. Having more base camps ought to make our survey work easier, huh? That's it. How about we head to the wolf hour like usual? I have the alpha variant. Which, I shouldn't say it like that. It sounds like I picked up the disease. Burmy's done. Geodude's done. Scyther's still learning. If we keep seeing him use... If I use X-Scissor more with him, I would actually start to uh, see it. Or just keep doing Agiles. Bricketune needs just a few more things. Just saw some pairs, so I'll have to get those. Any old chum, the usual potato mochi, please. I make it for three today as well. Sweet potato smoothies, here we go. Oh. You all heard of the grave news? A frenzied devore from the rumors that end up mauling some of our galaxy folk who went out to investigate this morning. The medical corps have had a hard time getting all the injured back on their feet. Uh, that is the or whatever that is reportedly struck by all by powerful lightning. Yes, I did see too that he's been behaving most erratically since then. Thus, so further investigation is ordered. The survey corps will, of course, step up to the task. A certain amount of danger is inevitable when researching unfamiliar Pokemon, but I'm sure my dad here can handle things just fine. He's said to be much, much stronger than even an alpha Pokemon, isn't he? And now you forget the strengths of Pokemon are key items of the information that we of the Survey Corps are duty-bound to research. Since this perilous work of ours calls for a clear head and fighting fit physique, we believe a good night's sleep is in order after this fine meal. Nom 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 nom. That just turns into like Dragon Ball Z eating. Eyes and shine, my dad. Boss wants you. It's that it, Kamado, that is. Get yourself to commander's office. I don't want it. Also, my uh, old apricot. Stun poke. Make it with stuns. All that dust. Move it, because I'm going to craft shit anyway. Out in the... Before I even leave. I might be wrapping up here. Craft now. I can't do it. Now. Wondering... Probably wrap up soon because it's almost it's like past 1 30 in the morning and like I said I'm not at a hundred percent here today working at like a 70 percent by back and forth feeling okay and feeling like crap all of them else balls and rest that out of this big potion that uh, couple of these pop up I think I need to leave I, I could just do it from there but it's Can't. 
put that away for now because I'm not worried about it. I can get a shit ton of that later. Super potions out so I have them. I'm already drawing their attention. The other thing. Save the berries. Later, take fives out because I'm. Alright, cool.